Hello everybody and welcome back to another video of Empires and Allies. Now I wanted to cover today one of the very first ever wars in this game. Yes, they have uh, alliance wars in this game. I wanted to go ahead and show you guys. All you have to do is click on the world on the bottom right hand side of your of your game here. And then click on this sword on the top part of the right hand side. And that's how you go to uh, start a war. But we go ahead and we already started a war and we wanted, I wanted to show you guys what, what it looks like here. So they pretty much have, um, we have I think a 10 on 10 or 11 on 11. And I use both my attacks and we're winning 33 to zero. I don't think they're gonna attack because we have them killed, but here's pretty much all, all our bases here. And it's pretty much you just uh, scroll around the map here and, and you find uh, which, who you wanna attack. But let's go through the enemy guys. I wanted to show you guys two of the, the higher attacks here. Um, I attacked a, a level 17 base and then um, we had Takers in the clan and he go ahead and he used a, a nuke and attacked another base. So I'll go ahead and show you guys some of these uh, these replays here of how they happened. And we actually got really close to not getting the whole 33 flags. But um, I used all drones and I had drones in uh, my from my from my clan mates and I used a couple airstrikes here to try to take out some of the only things that can hit the drones. Now the only thing that can hit the drones is the ground troops and the the sentry guns that can pop out of the domes. And you know you never really know what's gonna pop out of the domes, but um, it comes down really close here. I'm actually gonna speed this up because I actually killed everything. Now there's nothing else that can kill drones. Now it's all about time. And what what I did here was I used a uh, a couple airstrikes to kill as many buildings as I possibly could. To help these drones out like I said just came down to these uh, four little drones here just doing circles around all the buildings and barely pulled off the three flags here for, for the clan war um, I'll cover in another video on how much uh, how much loot you get per per war and uh, if you get all the all the flags if you get more loot but uh, after I killed the town hall I got the second flag and then I used the airstrike to clean up the rest so there's the three flags for the for the clan war or the alliance war let's just say and then we'll go ahead and we'll check out takers attack and this was their highest ranked players a level 36 and our highest ranked player went ahead and attacked him so let's see this replay this is something you, you won't you guys won't be able to see until a, a lot of future videos but i'll go ahead and let you see the nuke here and um he, he attacks all from one corner he takes out as much defense as he possibly can right at the beginning he, um, he does have a, a couple drones in his uh, his little clan castle here. So he went straight at the, the well, these lasers. <laughs> this is another video, obviously, that will cover the lasers. Um, the lasers come out of the, the domes instead of the machine guns. And then here comes the, the nuke here. It costs 25 commander points. I know, very explosive, very explosive. Well, I'll just give you guys a little sneak peek into what the, the, the nuke does here. This actually comes down to a really, 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 really close fight here. He does have a, a Titan tank here that you guys will, won't see this for a while on my videos. But um, we'll go ahead and speed it up and we'll show you how close this attack actually got. Now he has a whole bunch of defense left against uh, some, of the, some of the ground troops here he has left. And it comes down to, let's see, a tank and a, and a small soldier on the left. And the Titan on the right, and the Titan tank actually gets shredded here by uh, by, by this uh, this laser. And then the one ground shoot left, and he airstrikes it to hurry up. And he pulls off the three flags on their highest rank guy. So that's how we completed the war and got all the flags for our clan war. You guys tune in to, for some more videos on the, uh, how alliance wars work. And uh, thank you for checking out the video. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. See you guys in a little while.